Hello there, let's talk about how to export video from an Axis camera SD card. As you can see, my camera is already working, connected to my switch. It's an Egg Gear PoE switch that powers the camera. There's an SD card here inside, I have some recordings and I want to export using the web browser. As you can see on my screen, I have the image of the camera via web browser. I can move my hand in front of the camera so you can see that's working live, pretty good. But I have some recordings there that I want to export, okay? So let me just come back here to the web browser. You can use uh, different web browsers, Google Chrome works, Edge works as well. And then here on the main screen, you have this option on the left side for the storage. When you click here, you see how many recordings that you have there. Just click here on go to recordings and you're ready to go. Now you can check the recordings there. Let me check this one, for example, and I see here that I was moving boxes in front of the camera and I got that recorded and I want to export that, okay? So it's a pretty quick video, but here I can just click on this gear icon and select export. I can also check here on properties, the video. So that's the recording that I have. It's from an SD card and here's the time, local time and the resolution, 1920 by 1080, 30 frames per second, and video type is H.264, okay? The compression for this video. So here I just click this icon again, select export, and here I have the date and time from to, I just select what I want here, just or just check if it's correct, give it a name, let's say Axis Video Export, Zero 01, just as a text uh, test, okay? And this, the format here is the MKV. And I click export, and it's going to download to my folder. Sometimes using Google Chrome, it doesn't export. I don't know why, it's just a glitch, but let me just check here on my download folder. If I have the video here, as you can see, I don't. The video is not here. Let me just refresh here and try again. One more time, refresh here. I just look for my recording files there and try to export one more time, okay? So be aware of that. I was trying with Google Chrome. I was also trying with Edge. Sometimes it doesn't work with Google Chrome. Let me just select another video here. I have four of them. Then I see the videos. I'm moving my hand in front of the camera. So it's playing, that's the one that I want. I would just Pause it here, come back here and export again. Give it a name, access video export 02, zero 02 zero here. Just an example again, export. And just observe if it's downloading to your folder. It's not, as you can see here, there is no indication that it's downloading here. When I click here, something strange happens here. Sometimes it downloads, as you can see here, I did that uh, some time ago. And sometimes it gives just this error exporting recording.cgi. It's not working here. Let me just resume. It doesn't work, right? Some glitches that I have here with this camera. So let me try now with Edge. Same thing here, I have the exporting. Let me just come to live view again and here to recording. So go to recordings. Same process again, wait for it to load. i am just get this video with the box moving again and come to this gear, export. Now from Edge, video export from Edge. Just number as zero one and click export. And now I see that's downloading here, okay? Then I can just click here to open the folder and it's there. I can just select the video and see here, double click it and see it's playing. So here we go. It's playing good with the media player. Or if you're going, if you're having some problem with the media player here, you can use another one. I just right click here and open with VLC media player. That's a good one that plays everything. So usually when your player is not working, you can use VLC Media Player, okay? So this one is working pretty good. So 
as you can see, sometimes you have some glitches trying to use Google Chrome, then you can just try to use Edge and also update the firmware on your camera. Sometimes you just have some glitches like this, right? And Axis has a lot of small glitches and that works at least that way, okay? So that's all for today. If you like this video, please subscribe to this channel, leave your thumbs up and your comments, and I see you in the next one.